Hi. Long time no see. It has been almost an entire year since I last uploaded. So much has changed. So much happened. I mean, it was 2020, so... Welcome back, and if you're new here, welcome! First, I just want to say thank you to everybody who has left comments and asked how I've been doing. Um, seriously, that means so much to me, especially considering that I haven't really been uploading or as active as I would have liked. Um, hashtag 2020. Also wanted to say thank you to anyone who left a comment on any of my videos whether it was saying that they appreciated my video or they connected with my video. I just love the feedback that my videos have helped or affected you in some positive way, or even if it was just advice, you know, about uh, the ADD or the medication or my vape stuff. Like, thank you for interacting. Hoping to make a comeback. We'll see how that goes. Vape updates, briefly. I finally upgraded from my, what was that called again? I could have swore my old vape was in here. I got this a few months ago. Uh, this is a geek vape. Um, I got it in this like shiny iridescent green color with a matching tank, which I have tank updates. The last time I had posted about my vape was a Vupu Drag 2. Shortly after filming that one, I got a new tank and I have been hooked on this tank ever since. I swear by it. It is the best. The tank that I swear by is the Horizon Tech Falcon. Honestly, I haven't had a single issue with any leaking or anything of the sort since I switched over to this tank. And I have like three or four of them now. Actually, after I bought the first one, like last year, uh, the next day I went in and bought a second one because I loved it so much. This is my little vape bag that I carry around with me. I turned one of my like makeup bags into a vape bag. My favorite juice I have been purchasing every other week since I started vaping really, Coastal Clouds Blood Orange Mango Snow Cone, which actually they changed the name so it no longer has snow cone at the end of it. It's just Blood Orange Mango. I love it. It is my favorite. I did not expect to love it as much as I did can't go without it. And this is the Horizon Tech Falcon pack of coils that I use for my tank. I've been using the M1 mesh coil since I started using the Falcon. They have a bunch of different ones. Honestly, don't really know the difference of them. I just stick to what's familiar. So yeah, just to give you a glimpse of what this looks like. Overall, very happy with the Horizon, the Tech Horizon M1 Falcon. next on the agenda. Since my last upload, I have moved three times now. I've been living in this current place since November. We have the sweetest roommate ever. The room is a little bit smaller than what I'd like. I'm usually kind of a brat and prefer not to share a bathroom. That speaks for how good of a feeling I had when I came to look at the place and met the roommate here. So she is extremely sweet. We're both Geminis. It's so nice and such a weight lifted off my shoulders to have such a good roommate. I'm not gonna lie and say that mental health has been great. I think another reason why I didn't upload as much, even though like with the pandemic and shutdown, like I had plenty ample opportunity to make a dang video. I think it's just because like everyone was struggling at that time. I don't know. I know sometimes like it's for me at least to watch creators that I like open up about their mental health. I didn't feel like I could really make a difference in someone's life. I don't know how to explain what I am thinking. Um, I just... Sometimes, sometimes the self-esteem isn't super bright. I feel like I am more comfortable in my skin now, more than ever. I mean, I'm still insecure, but I'm like older now and comfortable with like who I am. 
Okay, let's try this again. Like, while I still have that normal insecurity that anyone has, on one hand, like, I'm comfortable enough with who I am. I can go out in public without wearing makeup, hair, and just, you know, my usual ponytail bun, bun thing, a fun bun. I don't remember if I've already mentioned the fact that I am an isolator. It's, it's pretty bad, not gonna lie. <laughs> Shutdown happened, I was kind of stoked because I could isolate and you wouldn't think much of it, you know? Because at the start of the pandemic, my lease had ended at the other place I was in, moved back into my parents, and my parents were getting ready to move to Wyoming. I don't know if I also mentioned the fact that I'm from Washington State. I grew up in the Portland, Oregon area. Family had moved out to Utah in 2018, and I had stayed behind in Portland for a while, decided that I wanted to be closer to my family, nieces and nephews, and my parents. They were out here, I came out here, got my own place and all of that. So pandemic happened, I moved back into my parents' house, they were getting ready to move to a new state. already didn't have the friends that I once had, where I grew up and, and knew everybody already. Somebody who isolates and then moving to a new state, not knowing anything or anyone, just trying to adapt. Where was I going with this? Oh, right, isolation. When the shutdown happened, isolation was already normal for me, just fell deeper into it. I had started a new job at the beginning of 2020 with the pandemic and everything, ended up losing that job, unfortunately. Being somebody with ADHD and dyscalculia, routine is everything to me. Everything. So my parents moved to Wyoming. Uh, I moved into a condo in Utah. Thankfully, I have uh, brothers who live here, two older brothers. I am the middle child of five, two older brothers, two younger siblings. That leaves me. I wanted to find a place where I could settle in, not have to move again for a while, but that lease ended and now I'm here. I don't think I'm going anywhere for a while. <laughs> yes. I don't want to go on too long, but I wanted to record a video. I've been seeing a lot of comments lately, people being like, hey, just checking in on you. You haven't uploaded in a while. Does anyone know if she's okay? Again, thank you so much. I have so much that I want to say about just going into my depression and anxiety struggles that I've been dealing with this last year especially. Just kind of get back, reconnect with everybody, my subscribers. Thank you so much. I can't put words into how much that means to me. I love seeing comments from people telling me about themselves and their experiences and their life, being able to connect and... I don't know what that was. <laughs> being able to connect and have people if you like understand you or what you're going through right now especially that is so important i'm so sick of the divide in the world like i'm so over it just want hopefully bring people together so yeah hello again I'm sorry if this video was boring if you have any questions or comments this was nice this was actually really really nice i don't know why i've been so scared to like down and record Especially in my car, I had comments of people asking me if I'm homeless. <laughs> I always record in my car, but it's just like easy because I have a little suction cup thing on my windshield that holds my phone up on a magnet and it's quiet in here and you can just focus. Why do I look so awkward doing that just now? Catch ya on the flippity flip. Catch y'all on the flip. I actually really like the lighting situation going on right now with the sun setting behind me. It's just a really complimenting shade right here. <laughs> Catch y'all on the flip. Why did I do that? Okay, shutting up. Catch y'all on the. Why do I keep doing finger guns? I hate goodbyes, mostly because I'm not good at them. Also, that's cute. I had it on my backpack in the sixth grade, on my Powerpuff Girl backpack. So, um, still, still stays with me. Okay. For real now. <laughs>